Hey guys, welcome back to CNC Life for another awesome vlog. Today we have a lot of stuff we're doing. I have a fun surprise for Carlos, but don't tell him. Carlos, you didn't hear that, right? I heard something. You did not. <laughs> I have a surprise for Carlos today, but I'm not gonna tell him until I can tell you guys in secret, because I don't want him to know. Let's get started with our day. First of all, hi CC. good morning. Hi Coda, whoa, you're not Coda. What the heck are you doing here? L Luna, is that you? What? Did you know Luna was here? Oh yeah. What? I where'd Coda go? You guys should definitely check out that video on So Cassie. Yes, check out our video on So Cassie because if you guys don't know, we got rid of Coda and we adopted our new dog Luna. Just kidding. You guys are so gullible. <laughs> Just kidding. My sister and I decided decided to switch dogs for 24 hours. So we're actually headed right now to go drop Luna off at the Missy's house and pick back pick Coda back up. But we did have Luna over for 24 hours because. These two are like BFFs, like for life. Well, I mean, no, I mean, it. CC is best friends with Luna. I don't know if Luna is best friends with CC exactly. But we did it because CC hasn't had interaction with other dogs. She finished heat not too long ago. Yeah. So we just wanted to have her be able to socialize with other dogs. Cause we're not 100 percent sure if she's completely done with her heat cycle. So before we go take her to go see other animals, we thought might as well let her see Luna, cause we know Luna's good and they like each other a lot. But we gotta take Luna home now, cause I gotta pick up my baby. I miss him. Look at these two, just BFFs. I don't know, I don't know if Cece's just annoying, but Luna's annoying too about it, so I guess it makes them <laughs> the perfect getting, duo. Luna's getting what she does to Karma. Oh my gosh, <laughs> okay. It's so cold outside, guys. Leave in the comments what the weather is like at your house, but in California, it is chilly and gloomy right now. It's so gloomy. It's cold and you were, we were actually thinking about going to Colorado to get a house over there, come on. <laughs> That was just a joke. We were never gonna move to Colorado. <laughs> it is super gloomy. Nice. I think it's gonna rain. It was raining overnight. Yep, look at what Cece did today. Yeah. She lives to destroy us, just yeah. slowly. She hasn't dug here in a while. She's been <laughs> digging over there on this side. <laughs> but we still love you, thank goodness, right? Oh, you know what, she won't do this if Luna's here, but she does, she doesn't care. <laughs> I guess Luna's staying for a little bit longer. <laughs> Missy wasn't even home, and I guess she's still wanting to keep Coda for a little bit. So we're gonna keep Luna probably for like maybe like the rest of the day, and then take her back later tonight. Just got finished eating, and I'm gonna head into the store because I have a surprise for Carlos today. I am gonna be making him a dinner, a surprise dinner. I'm actually really excited. I've been planning this for like a week. Um, Carlos has no idea what I'm making, but what do you think I might be making? I'm gonna guess something with steak. With steak, really? Yeah, only because you love steak. I do love steak, but I am making decisions off of you today, not myself. Fish? Mm, good guess, good guess, we'll see. All right, I'm gonna take <laughs> you guys with me though. I'll, I'll try to show you guys what I get. Hopefully they have everything at the store. Hopefully they have what I need. I will wait right here. You stay here, don't move a muscle. D d don't move a muscle. <laughs> All right, so I'm making Carlos a lamb and shrimp meal with some veggies. Uh, so far I have all the veggies, look. Corn, asparagus, all my seasonings, rosemary, thyme, that in it. Welcome home, Luna! She's like, thank goodness. Oh, well, sweet home, are you ready to see Karma? Let's go! I can't wait to see my baby, I missed him too much! You think Karma's gonna jump up at her? Uh, no. <laughs> Hello? Is that is that my where's my baby at? You're the wrong one. Hi, did you miss <laughs> did you miss her? Oh my god! <gasps> there he is! Are you Superman? <laughs> so I see all wet. Hi Coda! Come here, Coda! I missed you so much! I think he missed you too. <laughs> Are you ready to see Cece? Are you ready? Yeah? You ready, Superman? All right. Come. Come here, Coda. Did you miss Miss Cece? Oh my Cece goodness. Stopping. I think Cece missed him more. <laughs> come say hi. She's trying, she's like, come say hi to me. Come on, man. Cece, relax. Cece, why you don't want to say hi to me? Hush, you see, if you wouldn't hit him, and he'd probably come say hi to you, but you're hitting me. You're literally right. hitting me. Right. Hey, hey. <laughs> Break the cord. You got him, you got him. Good I don't job. Think he liked that. You got him. <laughs> he got a kiss and a cuddle. It's like, ew, cuties. All right, Cece and Carlos, 
Get your butts upstairs, it's time. Let's go, Cece, come on, you can bring it up here. I'm surprising you, get upstairs. Now turn on your game, you play PlayStation, okay? Okay then. Mm. Thank you, sweetie. Bye, I don't wanna hear from you. <laughs> I'm sure Car Carlos is heartbroken that he has to watch play Fortnite while I make dinner. <laughs> Chef Cassie in the house. Here's what I'm making Carlos today. The main thing I'm making, which I think I'm most excited about, is the lamb. Carlos really likes lamb, so I'm gonna make lamb today. I'm also making some Cajun shrimp. So I'm making a shrimp and lamb. It's like a surf and turf idea. It's kind of what I got going on here. And then I'm making one of Carlos' favorite vegetables, which is asparagus. And I'm also making corn. So I think I'm gonna I'm gonna do that. I don't know how to start it though. I'm not like a natural cook. Like what should I get ready first? Should I get everything ready and cook it all at once? I mean everything takes around the same amount of time. So I feel like if I put these various in for 15 minutes and then I put the lamb in and then I put the shrimp in last and the, I don't know, I'm gonna wing it. <laughs> Let's just start with the asparagus though. the asparagus ready here next up I'm gonna get the, the shrimp ready and then the lamb however I'm not gonna cook anything yet until like the very end because I want I want to cook it all at the similar time um, with the things might take longer first obviously but um, if you guys are interested in any of the recipes I work on today even if I don't perfect them I'll still have them linked down below if you guys want to check them out you guys might be able to make them better than me who knows <laughs> We have Cajun shrimp right here with the garlic ready to be added to the pan. I'm really excited for the Cajun shrimp. And I spent a long time on this lamb, but I had the lamb all seasoned and ready to go. This took me a lot of work because I, I don't make food very often. So I learned how to mince garlic. I learned how to chop thyme. I learned how to chop rosemary. I learned how to chop uh, parsley, which is not as easy as you think it is. Like you gotta like, peel it off and chop it up and throw it all together. And I'm really excited. I feel like it's gonna come out great. I'm gonna let this sit for a few minutes and then I'm gonna start cooking everything. Ooh, I'm so excited. Yes, and I have a wine for tonight for Carlos and I to drink with our dinner. I think so. Everything's taking a little bit longer than I thought it would, would be, so I did, I cooked the shrimp too early, obviously. And I've had boiling water sitting here for like five minutes because the lamb isn't done yet, and surprisingly, neither is the asparagus. So I'm just kind of like waiting now, because uh, Carlos likes all of his meats cooked really, really well. Like, he wants it super cooked. Like, no, no pink usually, especially when it comes to lamb. So I'm trying to cook it like a lot for him, because I don't want him to not like it because of that. Same thing for the shrimp, he likes them to be like cooked. Even though they were already cooked, he wants them like extra cooked. Takes a little bit longer though. I should have started this a lot a lot long ago. And I should have started the asparagus a long time ago too. Oh well, live and learn. Food is officially done. Let me show you guys the final product before Carlos comes downstairs. I definitely made like too much food, but there it is. A classic Riesling. Looks delicious. I know this Riesling is not really probably what goes well with this, but it's our favorite type of wine, so I went over not what will go with the food, but what we truly just like and enjoy. So now all I do is get his butt down here to try it. All right. Oh my gosh, this looks so great. It does? Yeah. Where'd you get the recipe from? I just got it from a bunch of different things. So we have Cajun seasoned shrimp. We have a lamb, which was seasoned with, was like. It was pre-seasoned? No, I did it myself. Oh, you seasoned I seasoned it with fresh parsley, fresh rosemary, fresh thyme, minced garlic that I minced, and then salt and pepper. And then the asparagus is just salted with like salt and pepper and like some garlic. And, and corn? And just regular corn, but I couldn't find corn on the cob. No, Cece, no, don't take Not it. you. I don't know what to try first. Now the shrimp, I'm, I'm a little worried about because I tried it and it was pretty spicy, but maybe you'll really? like it. Yeah, I, I made it pretty what? spicy, I feel like. It's not spicy at all. It's not spicy? Mm -hmm. I had it and I thought it was pretty spicy. I don't even taste the spice. No? Mm. Maybe that's just me then, because I had a bite of it and I was like, try the lamb, because I think the lamb will be the best. Oh wow, that looks nice and tender. Oh my god. Is it good? The lamb is really good. <laughs> mm. All right, well then I think we should eat. Well, you guys know how the rest of the meal is. Thank you, sweetie, so much. 
Mm. I love you. I love you too. All right, you're finishing up right now. What was your favorite part? Apparently it was everything because I ate everything. Well, yeah, <laughs> but what was your favorite? Mm. The lamb was really good. Yeah. But the shrimp had a good flavor. You like the shrimp the most? I can't, I don't know. My favorite part was definitely my lamb. I think that surpassed my, cause I've never made lamb, like on my own. <laughs> so for me, I surpassed my own abilities with the lamb. I like the shrimp, but I think I could do better. And then I really like the asparagus too. All right, that is it for the end of today's vlog. We hope you guys liked it. Carlos, did you like your dinner? Oh, I loved your dinner. Thank you. All right, we'll see you guys next time. Bye guys. Bye, bye.